G'day, my name's Fee, and today I thought I'd show you something a little different. So, I've been making this little memory box for a friend who's just about to have a kid, and I spent a couple hours each day over a couple weeks working on this little box, and it started off as something a bit more basic than this, and I thought, you know what, let's have a bit of fun, learn a few things, and try and test my skills. So I designed this top breaching box, tried to keep it as basic as possible inside. You'll see here, I've used a lot of slot joints and a few rabbit and butt joints just to pull it all together with dowels instead of screws. I did have to use screws for the hinges, but I kept it as rustic as possible and used some brass ones, and also for the top as well, you'll see here that I've used little screws for the latches. So inside I've used some thick felt that helps insulate the box but also make sure nothing gets damaged that gets put in here. So the aim of this box is to try and keep a secure environment for really precious memories. For now, it looks pretty. I've got some slide holes here that you can open up and store extra, extra little things that you want to keep compartmentalized. My original idea was to pop on the names of the children on each lid, but I thought I'll leave that up to them. I thought it'd be nice if they, you know, wanted to use it for their own um, wedding, uh, wedding memories or maybe other events in their life as well, and just have a secure box for it. That looks very unassuming, very rustic, and age, it will age well because I've used hardwoods and old woods. This memory chest will hopefully get filled up full of fun, warm, irreplaceable memories popped up on a shelf for 10, 20 years, gain some dust, and then have someone pull it off the shelf, blow off the dust, pop those latches, and sit down with their children, their family, and share all the wonderful things that lay inside, nice and safe and protected. Thank you for letting me share this one with you, and I hope you stay kind, stay curious, and stay creative this season. Merry Christmas, and I'll see you next build.